Now, I would love to be able to take credit for the powerful life analogy I'm about to tell you. Unfortunately, I absolutely can't. But this story and the poignant meaning behind it is instrumental in Emma and Sharon's love story and their decision to be together as a couple. It was part of an exercise and a lecture delivered by Emma's good friend, Sonia. Emma relayed the ribbon story word for word to Sharon and it hit home for both of them. You will notice a fair bit of ribbon throughout your day and your evening. That was the colour of the ribbon used in the story that is coming up. Now I'm sure that Emma and Sharon wouldn't mind if you took some purple ribbon home with you at the end of the evening to keep it as a little reminder of how they got here. In fact, your napkins at your table setting this evening will be tied with your own piece of purple ribbon as a little reminder of today. So imagine, if you will, a piece of ribbon, purple, like this one. The average female life expectancy is 83.7 years. Cut off the section that you have already lived so that in your hand you hold the remainder of your life. You will spend a third of that time sleeping. Snip off another third. You will spend 5% of your time waiting. <laughs> and the rest. <laughs> you will spend 1% on the toilet. <laughs> you will spend another 5% of your time eating and drinking. And the rest. That little bit of ribbon left in your hand, this short piece of ribbon, that's what you have left of your life, your choices and your decisions, your passions. The first lesson from this exercise is resilience. It's about control. It's about taking control for decisions that you make in life, respecting that your time isn't endless and choosing who you decide to spend that time with and what you want to do. The message here is to take charge of your life. Sharon and Emma made the most important decision of their lives. They decided that their passion was each other. They wanted to share the rest of their lives together and they took charge of their time. Don't hope, decide. Emma, Sharon, your tale is about to begin.